all right you guys i just wanted to get this video up here for you seems like harley is shattering their mold from years previous we all know that harley used to release their motorcycles mid-year like august they would start releasing them and then they would start shipping them to dealers and now we are on a schedule where they are releasing their motorcycles beginning of year. So last year we seen the motorcycles being released in January. We weren't getting them into the dealership till like the beginning of February. So it was a nice teaser, got everyone prepared for what was coming. And I really liked that strategy and game plan from Harley Davidson. This year we've seen something different. They teased a lot of these models, but they are also dropping motorcycles super early. So 2024 models were at the dealerships in 2023. So of those models that we've seen, they have revealed to us, at least on their website, they revealed to us that they're going to keep the Nightster, the Nightster Special, and the Sportster S. We see a price drop, a considerable price drop on the Nightster at 11.9, available in two colors. Now, something that I wanted you guys to keep in mind as we go down to the Cruisers, this is all they've released so far for the Cruisers. They are having a huge release announcement on the 24th of january so that's going to be something to pay attention to but i wanted to show you guys a couple things here we see the soft tail standard the breakout low rider s the heritage the fat boy the low rider st so that's great it shows us all these same models we got the street 114 street bob that bike's available in four colors. We're seeing a lot more color options this year. So like the Heritage is available in seven colors. This is what I want you guys to pay attention to. So Harley started shipping their Grand American Touring bike. So one of my local dealerships, Warren Harley Davidson has one of the Ultra Limited 2024s in. They also received one of the Road Glide Limiteds 2024s in. They have them for sale. They're available on the floor right now. Uh, Youngstown Harley Davidson, Newcastle Harley Davidson, couple other dealers that are close to me that are already receiving these new models. Now, what I wanted to let you guys know is there's got to be something crazy coming up in the pipeline. There's got to be something spectacular that they're waiting until the 24th to release because as you see in these Grand American Touring options, you are only shown three models. And then as we go into the trikes, they show these three. I already showed you guys a couple of them that have hit the floor at the local dealerships. I wanted to get those out for you guys as soon as possible. Look at the color on that tri-glide. That's absolutely amazing here, that alpine green. I'm waiting to see what they release in the touring models because I know they're going to have alpine green on the road glide special. There's got to be a huge teaser coming, you guys, because they are releasing these models here. They're showing us the front end. They're showing us the fairing on this new road glide limited we get to see it's got that uh og original style fairing on it with that same uh dual filament housed light on the front we're also seeing right here the teaser of the display where you're still gonna have that uh display out in front of you it's nothing like the cvo models i really wanted to show you guys this because i think that the normal models your road glide and your road glide special are going to come with a different 
fairing. They're going to come with different bags. They're going to come with a different display just because why else would Harley do this where they released just this here. You can see this has the original style fairing on it. Your display is all the way up here in front of you. It's got the original bags. It does have a little cutout here where they gave a little bit more of a definition to that bag. I think this is just a teaser for what we're going to see with the Road Glide Special and the Street Glide Special. I think they're really going to do something different with those bikes. If not, I think they would have already released them. We would have already seen them. So I'm going to get you guys up some pictures from my local dealership showing just that. But all it is is the exact same style fairings. As we go back here, I want to show you even with the Ultra Limited. It's the exact same thing. So you got this little teaser video here, but you got that OG style front fairing. You got the OG style display. Nothing that we haven't seen before. So for them to only release these models to us on the website, there's something going on behind the scenes. As you can see, display up here, gauges up top, and it's got the original Batwing fairing. So there's gotta be something coming down the pipeline that's gonna be really exciting, you guys. I just wanted to get this up. I wanted to show you. I wanted you to kinda have an idea of where my head's at and what I think's gonna happen. So it's really important that we pay attention here January 24th because like I said, I think this is going to be the year where we're going to see something really big from Harley. I think they're going to show us stuff that we were not expecting and they're kind of going to pull the curtains back and show us the future of Harley Davidson motorcycles. So here is the website for Warren Harley Davidson. I just wanted to pull this up so I could show you because it shows the pricing here. So 2024 Road Glide Limited shows the color that they have it in, which is this blue color, shows their pricing. You can message them if you are interested in this bike. But this is what I wanted to show you guys. So they do have real pictures of the bike that they loaded on their social media. But this is what I wanted to show you. These are the pictures coming from Harley Davidson. And I think we need to pay attention to the original styling, but also to the little nods to the future styling, like on these uh, bags here. Because I think that if they already release this bike here, and the only difference on this model is that kind of newer style uh, bag, but it's only a little difference. It's not something terribly noticeable but i think if we pay attention to that we're gonna really see what they're gonna do with the street glide and the road glide for the 24 model i don't know if it's gonna be a huge difference i don't know if it's gonna be to the point where you're gonna want to jump out and get one i don't think it's gonna be as in-depth as the cvo model was last year but I just wanted to show you again, they got the pricing on here and this is the Ultra Limited in the white color that they got. But the pictures from Harley I think are a huge teaser because a lot of people that are buying the Limiteds and the Ultras, they want that super classic style. They want a touring model that is a nod back to the heritage of Harley Davidson. So I think what we're gonna see going forward is going to be a huge upgrade on the street glide and the road glide and the road glide and street glide special i'm really excited to see what happens here so stay tuned you guys as more stuff comes up i'll get it out here for you i just think this is a huge easter egg to what we're going to see coming